Okay, this is going to be a review and install of the BA Tents Recovery Board Spare Tire Mount. So I'm running the, the Rig Supply Mega Swing. I have a 2500 Silverado. I'm going to take the Trasheroo off and put it under. But it's going to mount here on this open side. And we have the propane tank on this side, mounted on the inside with the table. These are the, they're basically like the x bowl, but they're the rug cell. I got them from Home Depot. I've used them once or twice. Um, they're, they're recovery boards that are pretty cheap. But from what I found, so first off, the... This comes, I've already opened it um, before I left town to make sure I had what I needed. So this is really nice. It's a steel powder coated bracket. It was packaged very well. It'll give you a nice strap. But there, and then good old stickers from BA Tents. You gotta have those. Add them to the collection. There's not hardware, so it's kind of a you install how you need to. So this is our adventure camping overland trailer. I'll link a description. There'll be a link. But I have the same boards we use to level it. Kind of work as wheel chocks. Keep it from sliding around. But these are just stainless steel bolts with a crush washer, a nut, fender washer on each side. And then at our tractor supply, they sold these guys so it's just a plastic insert that a 3 8 nut fits through and then you can tighten it down so I'm gonna replicate that onto this mount so this is this is what we're working with so crush washer two fender washers two regular nuts it's a 3 8 by 6 inch bolt got a drill bit I'll explain that in a second and then these are them so hillman they are two and a quarter inches fits a three eighths nut um so with my particular traction board my mounting holes are either way at the end or kind of here in the middle it's non-traditional at all um that doesn't line up so i'm gonna drill four new holes in the traction boards they're cheap enough that i don't feel bad drilling new holes in them um, they're already pretty beat up but i'm gonna go ahead and get the bolts put through and start this install So get the bolts on there. It's bolt, fender washer, fender washer, lock nut, 
and then the studs. So I'm gonna get it mocked up and then go ahead and drill out the new holes to mount that on there. That's how that's done. So it actually went through one of the feet, so that'll kind of hold it off the mount a little more. I'll probably file those down once I get back home, cut those off so it sits flush. But for now, it's looking like it's working. Drilled out four new holes, and then the other one should sit on top of it. But that's how it's going so far. Okay, so we're going to start the install of the metal plate. Now that we've got everything mocked up, I recommend two people. Um, I'm going to try and do it with one. Um, so they, in the video, by BA Tents, take the strap and go up through the bottom and through the top. in here so that end will sit flush with the tire put it on this side We're gonna start with it there. Um, with the ultra swing, it angles the tire in. So I'm gonna try and get this adjusted where I can still open the lid and be able to run the traction boards on the side.
So now I have switched the recovery boards over to the driver side. So as you saw, the handle to open the ultra swing for the mega fit actually hit the bottom of these particular traction boards and the glass also hit. And I probably fought with this and tried different scenarios for a good 20 minutes and came to the decision that they just needed to be moved to the driver side which I preferred them on the passenger side just to have that balanced um, look since I have the side hack with the propane tank off to the driver side but for now I have decided just to rock them over on the driver side and if I ever get different boards in particular or um, have some more time I might figure out a way to get it to work on the passenger side but with this particular case with the ARE camper shell and still trying to retain access to the glass opening when the swing out is closed I unfortunately had to put them off on the driver's side but overall the build quality of the BA tents recovery board mount is incredible for the price um, it solves an issue in a market for the ultra swings that is currently not there. So here's the final look of the BA Tents recovery board mount on a rigged mega swing. I have the trasheroo, I have a propane tank, and then I mounted it off to the passenger side. Or driver's side. It still keeps the license plate visible and it clears my ARE shell.